question here with me, which says, what if is a child of God? Is that the person? Is, this is how they ask the question. I, I just wrote, I wrote them down everything. He said, what if he's a child of God, but he cheats on you constantly? Should you still see the relationship through? You know, listening to this question, one would think that the person who has this who asked this question should know better. I mean, what is if is a child of God, but is he still cheats? Brother, sisters, please, do you think a child of God should cheat on people? So do you still need to call that person a child of God? So that is the kind of people we have in the world today. They still see that someone is a child of God, even when the person is doing the, right, the wrong thing. Even when the person is doing the wrong thing. Please, this question, the brother you're talking about, it, is never a child of God. Church attendees is different from being born again. Be regenerated is, is very different from being from just attending church services. So if you say a brother is cheating on you and is a born again, I have to cover my I have to cover my eyes for the person who has this question for asking that someone is cheating and still believe is a is a is a Christian, is a child of God. So don't confuse. A person who is cheating on you is not a born again Christian. Please accept that. A brother who is not stable, who is flattering around, is not a child of God. You know, the definition of a child of God, we, this time around, the definition we give to, to a child of God or someone who is a born again is quite different from the definition we give to. Born again, when someone is born again, you know what it is. When a person is born again, you see total commitment to the things of God. You see a great change in the life of that person. A tremendous change. A visible change. A change that you'll be able to say, oh, oh, God, Lord, is no more the kind of person I used to know. Look at the same born again you are seeing today, he will still put ragamuffin I mean, whatever oh, they, they would see since the year, they would see do all those. The, the kind of born again, the kind of Jesus they have received, I've never they received, I've never collected anything from them. No, you can come anyhow to the cross, but you don't remain the same way. You don't remain the same person, rather. You can come to Jesus anyhow. Come doing your anyhow, come wearing rags, come wearing. Uh, clothes that are not covering your body, but when you really meet with Christ, no, you don't. You don't remain the same person. So when you say the person is a born again and is cheating on you, sorry, sister, this is not a born again brother. So how do you define your own born again? Oh, he's a thing of heart. No, 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 doesn't matter. Hey, brothers and sisters, it matters. Everything you are saying, it doesn't matter. When you get into marriage, when you are there, you now know that, hey, Jason, this thing, um, um, you know that this thing really, really matters. Please do not take keep church attendees as a born again. This person is just attending church. Maybe because his parents usually push him to go there every Sunday. It's different from meeting with Christ and giving his Christ life to Christ. So, if you're in a relationship where a person is cheating on you, and you are saying, should you, see, should you still see the, mar the relationship through? Nah. Why would you stay there? It means that you too, you need salvation. You need salvation. If you don't know between your right and your left as a sister, as, you, as, as a born again Christian, it means you are not born again. Because the nobody should preach to you before you pack your slippers and carry your bag and take any bit everything that, that belongs to you and you run. You don't have anybody to use megaphone to tell you that you are in the wrong place. A person who is cheating on you while you are still single, ha, my sister, you become the second, you become the fourth wife. Oh. <laughs> if you are not even married before, so you don't become the second wife. 
So a person who is not faithful, ah, why you are cutting? Forget about it. You are naked when you are married. You are not covered. And that will not be your portion in Jesus' name. You, I can never advise you to go ahead in such a relationship where the brother is cheating on you. Go possible. You know the meaning of that? No. I can't advise you to go ahead. So don't, don't see anything through. The only thing you need to see through is yourself getting out of that place. And to go and ask for forgiveness for being in a wrong relationship in the first place. Because you are not sent to that kind of a relationship. You are not sent to that kind of relationship. Please, when you have a question, 